Hi, and welcome to Vincenzo's Plate. In this episode, we are going to make olives bread. When I went to Italy on holiday, I heard lots of people saying they make their own bread at home. The reason why is because of the economic situation, so they prefer to save some money. But on top of that, I would like to say, it's, it's nice to make your own bread at home because you should be proud of yourself and also you make your bread the way you like it and it will taste the way you like it. The most important ingredient, of course, is the dough. So to learn how to make the dough, you need to go to vincenzosplate.com and then you need to search for the recipe, which could be under Vincenzo's uh, basics or uh, video recipes. And you need to look for pizza and bread dough recipe. So we have about 450 grams of dough here. And then we have uh, about eight black olives and we uh, cut it and they are probably cut in, uh, one, in four pieces, basically. Now we need to put some flour on the board, a wood board. If you have a wood bench, you can use it. Sometimes the bench is a bit sticky. So now we're going to put the dough in there. So make sure the dough is out of the fridge 15 minutes before you do this. Otherwise it's too difficult for you to model it. Now we need to spread this out a little bit, so get the rolling pin to help you. Spread it like a pizza. And we want to put olives in there, just like this. And press hard inside. Now we're going to cover it like that. So we do one, then we do two, then we do three. So we just need to roll it like that. And then we do four, like that. Okay, looks good. Now we're gonna press it a little bit more. Not too much, otherwise break the olives. And now we do this again. I can feel the olives now. I can feel it. Now we press a little bit. We're going to put some more olives just outside, just here. Make sure you press hard. Okay. We have the bread. We want to do one more. Close it in half this time. Close this in half. We've got something left. It's, it's okay to have some olives outside. Not too many. Okay, so here it is. We've got our bread. Almost done. So make sure the olives are not on top of each other. It's so nice to make it your own bread, you know? Just get some flour, some more flour and put it on top like this, just like that. And now we let it set for about 10 minutes. At the moment, we are going to turn the oven on at about 250 degrees. Okay, now the bread is set for about 10 minutes. Now we need to get a tray with the holes at the bottom, so it cooks at the bottom and top. We need to put some baking paper on top, and then we place the bread on top like that. Now this is very, very important that you get a knife, and we need to cut it. We need to make a cut on top. So at this moment, I prefer to make it here on the side. So we need to cut this like this. If don't do that, the bread will explode. Okay, let's put it in. Now the bread needs to stay in the oven for about one hour, but if you think it needs to stay less or more, you just keep it in there or we'll take it out before. Once the bread is out of the oven, we wait about 20 minutes before we cut it. 
Now it's still nice and warm. What I did, I have some, um, on the side, I have some extra virgin olive oil and balsamic. And then we we'll just put some oil on top. And now the olive bread is ready to be enjoyed. Thank you very much for watching my show. I will see you in the next Vincenzo's Plate recipe. E ora si mangia Vincenzo's Plate.